The shelves in this Massachusetts supermarket are bare due to a long-standing family feud and a workforce in revolt. The produce department here, we would get two trailers a day. We've only had one and a half trailers in a week and a half. Warehouses for the market basket chain in New England have shut down. Workers refusing to make deliveries, staging protests and boycotts instead. Store managers are threatening to resign, all in an effort to reinstate their beloved CEO, Arthur T. DeMoulis. Our true president. He was fired by the company's board of directors about a month ago after his cousin, Arthur S. DeMoulis, gained control of it last year. It's the latest tit for tat between the two Arthurs in a family rivalry dating back to the 1970s. But many workers, customers, even mayors and state legislators seem loyal to Arthur T. I think it would be great to have Arthur T. come back in. I think it will solve a lot of problems. They're losing a lot of money. Business is down 90 percent of what we normally do in the store. Market Basket is a fixture in the Northeast with 25,000 employees and 71 stores in dispute over money and the direction of the company. Employees say Arthur S. and his supporters want more returns for shareholders, but Arthur T. is focused on lower prices for shoppers. The new executives say they don't plan any drastic changes to company operations. Workers have until Monday to return without penalty. Cindy Sharp, Associated Press.